Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. This is Wella and today we're opening, I'm opening my very first um, first edition box for Flesh and Blood. So this is Crucible of War, first edition. I was just at Pro Tour LA and managed to get this one box via trade. The playmat, by the way, is also from um, Pro Tour LA. I think this is the first time they sold this design. Or maybe I just I've just never seen it before. This is Wraith. I think it's nice, along with a swirling mist playmat. So okay, let's open this. So yeah, it's gonna be my first time opening or even probably touching a first egg um, box for flesh and blood. So wish me luck. Okay, it's thicker than the other boxes. The Welcome to Wraith and uh, ARC. Maybe I thought maybe because it has less than 24 packs, but the box says it should have 24 packs, and indeed it does. So maybe there's just less cards inside. So, what are the hits from the set? I don't even know. I think there's a CRU uh, tunic, uh, a non foil though. Uh, I heard there's the Art Knight Shard. It would be great to get that in gold foil. And then apart from that, I don't know what else. Um, yeah, I don't know what else. So we got the Crusher Week, Emerging Dominance, Salt Balloon, nice. Combustible Courier, Sleep Dart, Consuming Volition. Most of these are cards that I see in other people's decks. We got a foil riled up and cindering. Oh, Zen State is also a rare. And then we have cindering foresight and Zen State. Okay, we'll place the rainbow foils here. I'll set the comments aside. And it wouldn't have the pink stuff. Yeah, I don't think so. Okay, so we have a Dawn Blade, Brutal Assault Snapback, Riled Up Again, Sleep Dart, another one. A red Sleep Dart, yeah, it's not pink. Uh, Rainbow Foil, which is good. We have Rushing River and Promise of Plenty. Okay, next, another Riled Up. Meet and Greet, Fred Torresol, Sing Fist, Think Later, Sutcliffe's Research Notes, Rainbow Foil, Thing Death, oh, our first Majestic, and Towering Titan. I don't know the price of that. Is it a, oh, it's a Ranger action. Okay, not such a good card, but it's L. Okay. Pathing Helix, Bravo. Get him run, tap the balls in workshop, for should we? Soul beat strike, we got pitfall trap, rainbow foil, barrage and beat horn, and reinforced the line. Okay, uh, nothing too exciting yet. Okay, back in helix, so we need strike shock slam. Crush a week again, swing fist, think later, rainbow foil. Oh, we got a chimney. Um, it's a non foil. And we got promise of plenty. So we'll place it here along with M's. I hope we got a flavor. That's very early for a legend. I hope we get more. A cold foil legend, right? Oh, Fisher Eye. Combustible courier. Horn of Temple. Whoa, foil spoils of war. That's pretty good. Barrage and beat horn and foil dawn. No, it's not foil. But uh, I think those two are good cards. Both good cards. We also got Dauntless. Very cool. Okay. Next. Torn of Temple. It's not that flying kick. The Girls of Workshop. High speed impact. In Rainbow Foil, which is good, Mandible Claw, Rainbow Foil, and Mowbray and Skies. Alright. 
We haven't gotten a full spoiled yet. I'm not sure if each box has one. I hope so though. Hope we get a good one. Fable would be awesome. Got Kano, Dash, Rousing Either, Choke Slam, Simplicity Flater, Rousing Either, Foil, Talishore, The Lost Prince, and Edge of Autumn. Okay. Blessing of Serenity. We got a Rainbow Foil Soul Bead Strike. Promise of Plenty. Oh, and Cash Egg. Nice. First edition Cash Egg. Okay. They're pretty curled. So weird. Is it because of the one foil? Real Assault. A Rune Chant Token. Snapback Rainbow Foil. Rock Slide Trap and Cindering Foresight. Fresh okay. Week. Chokes them. Data Doll. Foil. And it's a little crimped as well. Interesting. The others are not, but yeah, this is a little crim. We'll set this aside your Dauntless again and reinforce the line in blue. And the Dauntless is red. Okay. Okay, yeah. They're kind of bent. Alpha Blood, Rousing, the Merchant Dominance, Sleep Dart, Swing Fist, Hit and Run, Bittering Thorns, Foil. Cash in and wow, another cash in. That's two already. And Centauri Seaver. Lots of good, lots of good pieces in this box. And so we're now in the second half. People assault so lead strike. And there's our gold foil. It's gold foil gamblers gloves. I think it's pretty good. Uh, unless Reiner and Kao are using something else now. Gambler's Gloves in Cold Foil, Magnetic Shockwave, and another Dauntless. Now, can we get a second Cold Foil? I don't know. But it's still pretty good. I think it's good. Fyra, Reiner, Crush a Week. Foil Rune Chant Token, Rushing River, and High Speed Impact. Okay, I'm gonna roll this up like this because we have no more space. I don't think we've seen other Majestics yet, but I'm glad that our cold foil is a Majestic. How about Snapdragon Scalers? Is it from here? Or maybe it's from ARC. Push forward, out for blood. Another salt balloon, but this time it's not foil. Reinforce the line. Oh, salt balloon is common. Okay. Reinforce the line, rainbow foil, crane dance, and dauntless. Kinathos. Push forward. For bottom bolt. Reinforce the line and cindering foresight. Heroes have seen so far. We've seen Kano, Renner, Ira. Um, I think there was another one. Crush a Week, Seismic Surge, Rainbow Foil, Russian River, and Crane Bands. So, we didn't get any uh, Cold Foil Legends or Fable, but, but we did get a Chinik. Azalea is here too. Overblast, World Up, Rainbow Foil, Dread Cryptic, and Harmonized Kadash. But we did get a Legend, which is still Chinook. And we did get a Gold Foil Majestic, which is pretty good, I think. And then Promise of Plenty, Rainbow Foil, 
Other frogs in plenty and a towering titan. Did I miss any M's or is there really not a lot of M's in the early boxes? Glittering thorns. Taklavosin's workshop. Oh, Metacarpus node would have been nice if we got this as the rainbow fall instead. Or maybe not. So it's our second majestic. Our first no, our second and high speed impact. One, two, three, four packs. Yeah. So we got something good. Four, sleep right over blast for us in either. Blood of force. Rainbow foot. Reinforce the line and the yellow dauntless. I don't think I see this too much. The yellow dauntless is not usually blue and red. Captain Helix chokes them. Sylvie Strike Rainbow Foil. Good Morseless, nice. And Promise of Plenty. Okay, last two facts. Overblast, Rainbow Foil, Barrage and Leap Horn, and Crane Dance. And the very last pack. Is it going to be another Toad Foil? Or maybe just give us a nice Rainbow Foil. What about Twinning Blade? Is it from here? Research Notes, Marvin and Skies, and Rock Slide Trap. Okay, well that's our box. Let's look at our Toad Foils. I mean, let's look at our Rainbow Foils. We got some good ones. We got Sylvie Strike, pretty good. A lot of forest, I guess. Not sure. The word. I don't know if it's been used. We got a couple of foil tokens. It's too bad we didn't get a full, uh, red reinforced line. I think that's the one that's been used. We got glittering thorns and rainbow foil. Baby the doll. Snapback. Sylvie Strike, cross and either. Spoils of War. I think this is the winner. And sleep dart, maybe. Yeah, yes. For Azalea. And then for the R's, we got a bunch of ninja pieces, warrior pieces, generic pieces. Don't miss, don't miss. Magnetic shockwave. We got a couple of fashion. I think that's good. And for the Majestics, of course, we got, uh, we got Remortless, Metacarpus Snowden, and Fame Death. It's only three. But we also got the Tunic, and we got a Cold Foil Gambler's Gloves, which is a Majestic as well. Well, there you go. It looks like a decent box. And if that was the only legend of the case, well, I mean, if cases only have one legend, well, at least I'm glad that it's here. Even if... Uh, this non-foil tunic is not worth that much anymore. It's still a pretty, it's still good. It's still a legend and it's still a staple. So yeah, I think that was a good box. I hope I can get my hands on a few more. It was fun opening it and seeing and opening. I love opening boxes when there's a chance to get a like a winning cold foil. So yeah, I really enjoyed it. So thanks for watching and see you at the next unboxing. Bye.